Campus M offers some great core functionality to the app, but we really wanted to take it a bit further and tie it into other systems and data sources, and the AK lets us do that in a way that's um, platform agnostic. That's the big thing for us. We don't want to do one thing for one, one device and not for another, so it just lets us do it across iPhone, Android and Blackberry, so it ticks all the boxes. We felt that um, we wanted to take the platform to a level that um, where we could add value on top of the um, the work that Onville had already done, so that um, we could provide Lancaster-based specific um, applets that targeted our users' needs. We have um, bus timetables uh, within within the app. Um, this is actually uh, live location um, information about our intersite uh, buses that run. So we can show within the app the position in, in real time of each of these buses uh, to the student or whoever's using the app. We've also produced a financed application which allows students to be able to see um, their credits, um, their invoices, um, whether or not money's gone into their university accounts from sponsors. Um, that's been well received. We've only been using it for the past two, three months or so and we've developed a system which uses data feeds from Transport for London to display the nearest Boris bike stand, nearest uh, tube stations and nearest electric vehicle charging points. We had a training day uh, which was organised by Onbill. They came down to see us at Sussex and um, we had a, a really good detailed day just going through uh, uh, everything you needed to know about the AEK. In terms of skills it's quite funny because I haven't done any programming for years um, so I, I didn't really consider myself to be a developer yet I was able to pick up the AEK on my own really easily. I really like it. Like I say, it's um, it's a powerful tool for actually producing stuff that's cross-platform without having to get bogged down in testing on every single device and developing for each device. The overriding thing with the AEK is the, is the flexibility it gives you and the, the sort of uh, ability to do many, many things potentially if you've got that uh, data available for you to, to consume within, within the actual app. Uh, it, it, it just gives you that uh, ability to extend the product um, as you need really. It's been very liberating because we've been able to, um, to put things into practice really quickly. I think the greatest thing about it is that you can just um, write a few lines of code, you, yeah, you create the screen and then that's it, you know, within minutes that's available across all the platforms, so on, on all of the native apps and on the web app as well. And, and it's been great to have that power. We've had some really great feedback from finance because of the way in which we've lessened the demand on the cashier's office because students can thus check their current statement on the go. And so that's had some real business benefits um, for the finance um, office. A lot of students have, uh, have, have taken the time to comment and say that they've enjoyed uh, or, or they appreciate the extra services. But they've also been asking for even more as well. So that's, I think that's quite a positive thing because it means that students are a lot more engaged so it's allowed us to do something and try and distinguish ourselves from competitors in some ex extent. So marketing are really pleased with that and they've been promoting it heavily. Um, we, you know, we use it for open days and things like that. So it's, it's, it's been really well received organisationally. Being re responsive um, to the university's needs in such a short period of time is a massive business benefit. Mm -hmm.